Hey guys, it's uh, day one of ESWC. This is our first interview. I have with me Fries of SK. Um, the SK are placed in Group C with Luminosity, Navi, and Titan. And the last time we saw them, well, I'll ask you, uh, last time we saw you guys was Gfinity Summer Masters. And even though you uh, left in the group stages, you took both teams that you played, uh, Titan and an IP, sorry. Uh, you took them both to really close games. Uh, were, is, were the games close because you guys already had some kind of chemistry going? And did you only lose because you were a new team or was it just uh, your first event so you kind of had to bond? Is it something like that? I don't know. Against an IP, we, we had the first map, Cobble. We should have won it like already in, before it went to overtime. I don't know. It's was because of the good crimson. I think it was um, between two things. Uh, the other four hit all the shots, and we did some good strats. Um, that's what, yeah, that was what it did. And then we went to overtime, and then everything's fucked up. Hello went to make that two aces, and both of them was only because of we did a lot of lot of, uh, a lot of mid stacks. Um, yeah, we should def definitely have won that one and the cash game against Tyson's it was in front 11-2. Yeah, we should have closed that out as well. But yeah, we have played a little, a little bit more. We haven't practiced so much because we had so many official games. But I think we have done, done it okay in the officials. Um, yeah. Uh, you mentioned nice strats. Speaking of strats, uh, if I recall correctly, Barry is the new IGL, right? Yeah, he is. Um, but we all do the strats. Like, he's good mid-round caller now. Um, we have always have, also with Hunden, we got good strats, but the mid-round calls was really pure. Um, now we do the mid-round calls really good, and then if it doesn't work, we have the strats to go back on. So, I think we have a bigger um, tenth of gameplay now to to make it count against the better teams if something doesn't work um, but we have to see uh, on ourselves and we have to hit our shots if we have to get through this group uh, and speaking of the group uh, you obviously know have experience playing Navi Titan but there's also another team Luminosity and they just brought in probably you know someone you know Devil Walk uh, is do you still feel confident considering that it's kind of a chaotic group now that it's not sure? And also the fact that Navi did manage to get seized and flamey at the last second, which is really unfortunate for you guys, I guess. I mean, depends how you look at it. But yeah, how do you feel about the group in general? Mm, I feel it's, the, it's a really hard group and I feel a little bit disappointed about the group because we fly to Montreal and we have to play like almost three international teams. Uh, that was not what I expected. Um, I think it's hard. Okay, Titan haven't been shown good results, but everyone know what they can do. Now it's just good. <laughs> and then we are even with the last guys. We don't know what to expect about them because they just bring in a new player like we did before in Definity. We played good there. They can play good now. We don't know. <laughs> Have you ever practiced with them actually? Uh, or not, never before? Never before. We No. <laughs> okay. um, and uh, is there anyone that you personally think at the event, not just in your group, that people are underestimating that you know people should be on the lookout for? Any team? In our group? No, no, in the whole event, you know. Yeah, actually, I, I believe Keith is one of the really good teams in terms of aim, skills, and strats. Uh, yeah, I really believe they're really good. They got a really hard group in ASEA. Um, yeah, I believe they can go top four at least. Okay, and um, I guess uh, that wraps it up. Uh, you guys seem pretty confident though. Is there anything you want to say? Any last shout outs, dedication to anybody, something like that? Any thoughts about the event? Yeah, I just want to thank uh, Alex, the Slash, from bringing us here. It's with that short term. I know it has been a lot of cost. Um, we will try to do our best and of course all our sponsors. Okay, uh, this is uh, our first interview, but we're going to have a lot more, both text and video, so stay posted to hltv.org.